These days, filling up a trolley empties the pocket at what seems like an alarming rate. Shoppers are hit on all sides with the effects of a drought, fuel hikes and good old profit margins. News24 visited four major supermarkets to conduct a price check. We looked at salad tomatoes, medium potatoes, onions and Granny Smith apples. We also contacted wholesale markets in Chwane, Durban and Cape Town. Here's what we found. Chwane's market had the best price for potatoes at 3 rand 82 cents per kilo. Durban had the best price for onions at 4 rand 84 cents and apples at 5 rand. It had the worst price for tomatoes, almost as much as you would pay at a supermarket. Cape Town's market prices were fair, but not the best for any of the items. On to the supermarkets. Clearly Woolworths charges the most per kilo for fresh produce, but in some cases the price difference between Woolworths and Pick and Pay is minor. Look at tomatoes and apples for instance. Fruit and Veg City was the most reasonable overall, with all the items under 10 rand a kilo. By far their best deal was on apples, which cost less than a third of what you would pay at the top end. So what do we make of all these numbers? Wholesale markets are cheaper, but probably impractical. They tend to be far out and prefer bulk buyers. There are some good deals at supermarkets, but you have to check weight. Fruit and Veg advertised potatoes at 59.99 for a 7 kilogram pocket. Sounds like a good deal, but ShopRite offers the same pocket for 10 Rand less. Of course, what the numbers don't reveal is the difference in quality, both in the goods and the stores. Farmers say quality has diminished due to the drought. High-end supermarkets pride themselves on guaranteeing quality from farm to fork, all at a price. It's really about weighing up price and quality. Some would say we're comparing apples and oranges here, but it's up to South African consumers to vote with their wallets.